morning, um, I'm David Thomas. I'm one of the archivists here at the Cornwall Record Office at Truro. And today I'm going to talk to you about one of the iconic documents in our collections. It's a very visual document and it's a document that is one of our big treasures here at the Cornwall Record Office. It's a document called the Buller Attainder and it has a wonderful portrait of Queen Elizabeth I of England and it shows her with her um, white lead painted face that she had when uh, after she had smallpox in the 1560s also shows her red hair and the border of the document is illustrated in real gold and also with cobalt blue and also it has a border of flowers and strawberries which is actually very similar to another document we have for Week St Mary some years ago before in 1506. This document is dated 1579. It has at the bottom the Great Seal of England with the real silver wire and it's been repaired. And up here at the top of the document we have the two names that are vital in the story. You have George Carey who's receiving the lands and Francis Trujian of formerly of Probus, who was actually deprived of all of these lands by the Queen. Why was that so? He was actually a Roman Catholic, and he'd harboured the Catholic priest Cuthbert Main, who was executed by Queen Elizabeth in 1577. Uh, Trajan himself was imprisoned for 28 years, eventually was released by King James I around 1605, and died in uh, Lisbon in 1608 and was quite nicely buried upright to represent his stand against Queen Elizabeth I.